Hi friends, it's Miss Laro here and I'm here today with you to do your health and safety lesson. Our health and safety lesson today, we'll be discussing phone numbers. You need to know your phone number or other phone numbers in case there's an emergency and you need to contact your parents or your guardian or you need to contact the police or any other emergency numbers you might need to know. So we're going to get started by writing Miss Laurel's number. My number is seven two, four, I'll put it in parentheses, we have eight, three, six, zero, zero, nine, nine. So in our packet today, we got some numbers that look like this. All Miss Laurel did was cut them out, and I put mine on some bowls, and I hung them up. You may hang yours on the wall or on the floor, but we're just gonna go tapping these numbers so that we can start to begin to learn our phone number. So it goes seven, two, four, eight, three, six, zero, zero, nine, nine. Another thing I have for us to practice our numbers is this mock phone right here. So you can also pretend as if this was your cell phone and that you were typing in your number. So if this was Miss Laurel's cell phone, I would type my number in 724-836-0099 and I would press the call button. All right, so one of the ways Miss Laurel remembers her number is I chose to make a song out of mine or a poem or to tell a story. Those are the best ways to get yourself to remember your phone number. So this is how Miss Laurel's song or story goes. I like to imagine that my numbers are at a party. My numbers are going to a party. And this is how my song goes. It goes seven, two, four are at the door, eight, three, six, they're eating party mix. Zero, zero, nine, nine, waiting in the pinata line. And that's how Miss Laurel learns her numbers. So please, while you guys are at home, come up with a real cool way to learn your phone numbers. And don't be afraid to share them here with Miss Laurel. All right, thank you guys. I will see you later.